Four weeks in and another four weeks to go. No training, just sitting around, legs elevated. Just thinking about when I'm gonna be able to train again and what I'm gonna be able to do. Looks like the cycle is gonna be the thing to do, unfortunately. I miss the cool early morning runs on the trail. The birds chirping, the air is nice and fresh. I love the feeling of the sun starting to hit me on the face as I'm running. The mist. I miss being with my friends at the start line. The running, the exhilaration, the adrenaline rush. It's amazing. There's nothing like it. I love being with my friends when we're running. The goofiness that we do. We don't just race, we have fun. But for now, I'm in air casts and I just got to deal with it. It's a healing time. And I learn from it, like we learn from everything that we do. But still, I have to wonder, how did I get here? Did I do too much? I did, but there was other factors to play. And still, I have to learn from it. I have to move slow now. I have to rebuild, get stronger, move in a different pace. But it doesn't matter, I'm still going to move. I should be doing the Niagara, the Ragnar relay race with my friends this week, but that's not going to happen. I feel like a disappointment to them, to myself. I wish there was better circumstances that I could be with them and move along with them in their journey. I'm going to miss them. But instead, I'm gonna be hopping along here in my air cast, in my crutches, but I'll see them when they get back and I'll talk to them and I'll see what they post online. Because that's what we do as a society. We see what people post online as well as I do. I do feel bad though. I feel like a burden. They have to put the extra mileage in now because I can't run. And that does put a weight on me. And I am sorry. But I am a survivor. We all are. We move in a certain direction and we figure out which direction to go. We don't stop or turn around. We just keep heading in that forward motion because that's what we have to do. And as I sit at home, and I'm not going to dwell on it, they're having fun and I wish I was having fun with them, but I'm going to experience the things that they're experiencing just in a different way. Like I said, everything moves forward. And I just think about all the times that I've done certain things and over the year, I've had amazing time and journey. I've put review out there, trail running videos, and I'm gonna keep doing that because that's what I do. I enjoy it, I love doing it. I do it for you, I do it for myself. Running is a passion for me. And I'm gonna keep running until I'm sick of it. And at this point in time, I don't think that's ever going to happen. I love running and I hate having to explain to people why I love to run. I just do. And you have to accept that. The look I'm giving you right now is not for pity or sympathy. This is the look of determination. This is the look that I'm going to stare at and give you all as I move forward. We should all be looking like this. We have to look forward and strive for something better. So as we take a journey with my wife, my friends, whatever, I can't wait to see what I paths I go on to next. I have lots of running journeys to do and to explore and to give to you guys. And I can't wait to do it. There is so much more to come with so many more friends to help along this journey. And I hope you enjoy this.